Hello and welcome to the fourth episode of Behind the Railway Series, where we take a look at the stories of the Railway Series and locate their real-life counterparts in history. Next up is the series' fourth book, Tank Engine Thomas Again, first published in 1949. All of the stories are based on Thomas's branch line. The first story, Thomas and the Guard, involves Thomas being so impatient to start his journey that he leaves the guard behind at the station. Next, in Thomas Goes Fishing, Thomas has to pick up water from a stream, but also picks up a bunch of fish with it. After meeting a kind tractor in Thomas and Terence, Thomas finally understands how mechanical diversity can be useful. Lastly, Rail goes up against Road as Thomas races a bus in Thomas and Birdie. Tank Engine Thomas again had its start while the Reverend and Christopher Audrey worked on a model of Thomas's branch line. When the Reverend's publisher asked for a new book, the Reverend Audrey decided to base it on Thomas's branch line. Stories were again inspired by the Railway Gazette's scrap heap column. Thomas and the Guard was based off an event that happened at Eastbourne, and Thomas Goes Fishing is based off an anecdote by a Scottish engine driver who used to keep an eel in his engine's tender to eat algae and keep the sieves clean. The last two stories, however, have more abstract origins. There are limited accounts of trains being rescued by tractors, but there have been several instances of trains getting stuck in snowdrifts. Likewise, many bus and engine drivers are reluctant to admit to having races, but a similar event happened in the Ealing Studios comedy The Titfield Thunderbolt, made four years after this book's publication. Tank Engine Thomas Again was yet another commercial success, although some readers felt that Thomas and Bertie's race was unfair due to obstacles on the road. In response, the Reverend drew up a map of Thomas's branch line and the road alongside. Eventually, this would lead to several more maps of the Fact Controller's Railway, and the creation of its own region, the Island of Sodor. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, feel free to like, subscribe, and share, and also leave a comment below. Until next time, I'm Captain Rutledge. Good day.